This way, freaks and geeks. This way for adventure. This way for horror. And this way for God knows fucking what. Um, welcome back to Resident Evil 7. Uh, I'm sorry, Resident Evil 8. I don't know why I said 7. I've been thinking about that game for a minute. And how it... What, what, what Resident Evil 7 has to do with this? Because there's a lot of direct conflict right now. We thought we killed the mold. Turns out we didn't kill the mold. And it has something to do with whatever's going on in this little backwoods village of, in Europe. Um, but this way, I guess. Uh, welcome back to another episode of Resident Evil 8. Or Resident Evil Village. And welcome to another episode of Horror. So we're getting right back into this. We uh, got the third flask. We need one more. Heisenberg is attempting to make some kind of deal with us, which we're not that dumb. We know it's a trap. We know he's not going to honor it. And we're just going to go ahead and probably kill him anyway. Uh, we got the cranks. So now we can open up these little doors right here. We did get the sixth wing unborn key. So now we can do that too. Um, so we're just going to do a little exploring before we move on. She would always vomit. Chicken. Poultry. Poultry. Gimme, give gimme give that poultry. Um, well, I don't know what's supposed to be in there. There's an arrow. What does that mean? What does that mean? What's the arrow mean? Ah, okay. Yellow quartz. Cool. Cool. Let's go up the ladder. I don't have any clue what I'm doing right now. Ah, <sighs> chest here. Pigeon blood ruby. Is that combinable? Is that something I need? Combine the necklace. Now we're just needing one more piece of the necklace. Very valuable, very valuable, very valuable. Valuable combinable. Not able to combine that with anything yet. And okay. Cool. So that's what we know. Um what else can we open up now? Oh well, we can get the six door key now. We can activate the drawbridge. Uh, what else? I really... He would not have marked that. Treasure... Riverbank Treasure House. Does that have something to do with the drawbridge, maybe? So, yeah. We're not going to go straight into this one uh, with the story. I want to do a little bit of uh, looking around. Seeing what we can find. We're going to go ahead and deposit those two flasks into this pedestal. Just out of curiosity. Maybe we'll get some answers. Arms flask. Legs flask. And nothing. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. So we're gonna go back this way and check out that drawbridge real quick. I doubt we have what we need to get into this, but we'll try anyway. Oh! So that's what Louise's key went to. I was just doing that out of just curiosity. I didn't think that would actually work. 
Cesare's Goblet, an antique goblet that was treasured by Cesare, one of the four founders. I don't recognize that name. But okay, I'll work with it. Why not? It's treasure, so. Alright, so now we should be able to activate the drawbridge and get across. And see what this does for us. Maybe now we can get back into the castle since we have all these key items. But I feel like there's something, dude. I, I know we didn't get everything in that fucking castle. There was just so much. I know we didn't get it all. Get in the boat. Yep, yep. Okay. This way? Question mark? Can I go fishing? That's a kind of cave up there. Uh-oh, 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 Okay. Uh, what's this? What does this be? Why is this cutscene? Why is he doing something dramatic? Oh, I didn't think that would work. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Kind of cool that that worked, but... Oh, look at all that. Ooh. Gimme, gimme. Another one. Five handgun ammo. We got a lot of handgun ammo now. It's gonna stop. Uh, I get it now. Okay. I had it figured out. I just wasn't doing it right. What was that? Sniper rifle ammo? What was that? Magnum ammo? No? I don't know. Okay. Well, uh, come on. Come on. Yeah, man. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. There we go. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Golden Lady Statue. Magnum Ammo, I see you. I see you over here. Oh, I see you. I mean, I can. Ooh, if we get to craft Magnum ammo, I will be so, so happy because I know what I'll be doing. Nothing but crafting Magnum ammo is all I will be making. It's just Magnum ammo after Magnum ammo. Like, fuck all this other shit. We're getting so much money. We're getting so much treasure. Yeah. 
Does this mean we're gonna be able to get back into the castle, or am I just screwed on that? Yes, I know I keep saying it, but until it comes true, I'm gonna keep on saying it. That looks like a way back in. That looks like, no, that looks like something else. No, wait, 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 no, no, maybe not. Oh, well, I forgot I had the crank for this. Okay, is this another treasure site? It is another treasure site. Okay. Looks like I climb. Climb up that. Okay. 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 Simple. Bomb. I'm probably gonna need that for something. supposed to accomplish um, I don't quite understand what I was what that was supposed to accomplish. dynamite for something and I don't know what it is. Magnum ammo. More magnum ammo. I'll take all that out I, I get. And what do we got? Large pigeon blood ruby. I feel like I know what to do with that. Is that what I need to finish my necklace? Combine? It is. Yes. The, the necklace is complete. Dimitrescu's necklace. Very valuable. So is I. Nope. Cool. So the only thing I'm missing is whatever needs to go with Azura's eye. Cool. See, it's just little things like that. Just little puzzles that just make it interesting give me something to work for 
even though right now I don't know what I'm doing with all this money because I've already pretty much bought everything. So unless there's another stage I don't know about and more equipment or weapons that I can get. Like this is pretty much it. Okay, so that was the way back. Can I go back this way? I cannot. Okay. River then? And pretty much all I can do is back there, go back down there. This episode is going to be specifically dedicated to just messing around. I'm gonna give it about 15 more minutes of messing around and then we're gonna get into another actual episode where we move on. I kind of do hope Chris is alright, but at the same time, like, buddy, Chris, I know you've always had issues with, with communication, but dude, what kind of drug you been into all this? The least you can do. Fish. The least you can do, Chris, is just tell Ethan what's going on, or what you think is going on. Because you already put him in this situation to begin with. You think he wants to be here? No. Ethan just wants to go home. Ethan wants to be a free elf. Reminiscent. What's that? Ooh, foregrip for the shoddy. Oh, nice, 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 very nice. I like it. Okay. I've got a lot of just no space in my inventory. Flashbang, explosive. Fine. DNA sequencing completes 99.95% match to Dolby Mutamycete. The deviation of 0.5% can presumably be attributed to artificial changes by humans, which means it's probably the source. Further investigation to how the connections managed to find and extract the mold is needed. The fungal colony is spread out under the entire village. When you take the Baker incident into account, the hosts of the Mutamai seat are part of a network of consciousness. If that network is linked to here, then we could assume its organism here is data storage. If that's the case, then what data is Miranda after? Wait, what? Oh. Oh. What? Freaking... This better not be Eevee or... Or Mia trying to bring back Eevee. I swear to God if it is, I'm just gonna... You know what? Oh, that was a waste. Good to know. Deuces. I'm out. I got what I wanted. Okay, so that's good to know. So yes, it is, in fact, the mold. How it's here. 
from what looks like that other organization, the Connections. Whoever that is. I remember Red Umbrella was the very first people to create the viruses. Um, then when Red Umbrella was narked on, Blue Umbrella was formed. Along with the BSAA to fight bioterrorism. Um, I'm still not quite sure. I'm thinking that the connections are maybe a variation of Umbrella Corp, of the Red Umbrella, that's still up to their dirty tricks. I don't know yet. I can't tell. Okay. Uh, so there's treasure under the stronghold, cannibals plunder. So there's still two more freaking. There's still two more spots, and that's not even including where. Uh... Oh no! Wait, no Heisenberg. Yep, there, there's his shit. Got the riverbank treasure house. Okay, let's go ahead and turn in our treasure. See what we can get ah, from the Duke. My apologies. How'd you get that? Uh, no, I want to know how you got that. Okay, so thirty. Dad, gum. Intricately designed coin looks like one from the Baker House. Probably because it is. It's Matrescu's fifty thousand. Oh, we are so rich. We are so filthy rich. I don't want all this gold. We don't know what to do with it. I don't know what to do with all these mines either. This is Lord Burroughs? I suppose it's what they call the beauty of the grotesque. Uh, sure, buddy. Sure. Gunsmith. Oh, we can upgrade. Oh, we can. Oh. Oh, we can upgrade our shit again. Oh, yes. I Sorry, I'm a little bit happy now. You, Mr. Winters. Um, do you, are you offering anything? Nope, nothing new. Cool. Okay, so then we're going to go ahead and upgrade everything. Because we have the gold for These it. hands are more dexterous than one might think. Fire. Reload speed. Ammo capacity. See, you can put two hands around that extended mag. It's just, it's so, bleh, it's so long. There's no need for it. Ammo. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. What? Ah, it's fine. All finished. Oh. Sorry, we got to get rid of all this gold somehow. Uh, you know, I think I'm good there. Amy, no mind. Duke's Kitchen. What do we got? What do we need? Okay. Damage taken well. Mm. Mm. I'm good. Supplies. Okay. Securing goods is more. Thank you for so, your patronage. We really need some kind of organization here. I want. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Just move that real quick. Move that. Move the handgun over. This somewhere else. This somewhere else. Oh no. Oh <laughs> no, there's nowhere to move it. Um, okay, move that over. Uh, how do I rotate? Okay, good. amount of room we've got is a little sad. Um, tell you what, uh, okay, that always comes in space. That's a little bit better.
I just want to move the sniper rifle down somewhere else. We've got so much handgun ammo, it's ridiculous. Hey, what? Let's just let's sell the meat. You wish to sell make the a meat. Purchase? There's nothing in the meat that I want. The next upgrade that I'm yeah, the next upgrade I want is just needs fish. To hunger. Used to be alive. So let's just sell the meat. Let's sell the poultry. Ah. And that'll open up some space. A good deal. There if we I go. I say so myself. There we go. Excuse me. Move the revolver over, move the sniper rifle down, move the revolver up, so the handguns are in all in the same space. So let's move all of our weapons that are single-handed up here, move this down here, meds right here. So you can open up space, I believe. As long as you are organized. I know that doesn't sound right. I know it doesn't seem right, but. And that's because it's not. <laughs> I just like to think it is. I like to think that the more organized you are, that the more space you can have. Yeah, I've got a lot of pistol ammo I don't know what to do with. Like, a lot of pistol ammo I don't know what to do with. Oh, another bout of pistol ammo. Gee, many Christmas. Well, it's not so unsightly now. That looks a little bit better. Okay. Now we're organized. Um, I'm pressing F. Oh, there we go. Reload. There we go. Did that just open up a spot? It did. It did open up a spot. Okay. Um, we're gonna go ahead and end this here. We messed around, we found some stuff. Uh, so the next stop is going to this stronghold that, uh, Jackass wants us to go to. So, thank you for watching. I know this episode was just a bit of a waste of time, but this was more of a, for me, in all honesty, kind of thing. Uh, y'all know the drill. If you like the video, like, subscribe, share with your friends, and as always, have a good one.